I am here with two former San Francisco 49ers cheerleaders here at the reunion. You ladies doing well tonight? Doing very well, thank you very much. Having a great time. Yeah, it looks like everybody's having a great time there. Right. Yeah, quite an event. So, um, uh, give me a little bit of background about yourself. I actually was on the first team of cheerleaders for the San Francisco 49ers back in 1983. And I cheered for the team for seven years, then I moved into management and directed the team. I also coordinated the San Diego Charger Girls and was the co-founding director on the NFL Pro Bowl cheerleaders. I also, for the NFL, coordinated their foreign games for the American Tokyo Bowl. American Bowls that were in Tokyo cool. and Barcelona and Germany. Uh, so I've had a lot of experience in this field. It's an area that I love. It's an area that I love to get back to. Currently, I, uh, 25 years ago, I founded a uniform company that specializes in uniforms for professional sports teams. NFL, NBA, hockey, if it's professional sports and they have cheerleaders, we costume it. And that was 25 years ago and still going strong today. We have a, a team of people that work with me, and part of that team is a sales rep team throughout the United States that helps to our customers to purchase outfits. And all of those sales reps, the prerequisite is that they had to wear our costume at one point in time. So a lot of those team members that work with me today as sales rep for our company for the House of AKD are here tonight. And yes, it's fabulous. Wow. And yeah. even looking at some of the old costumes yeah. that they have out, the Atlanta Falcons, Angela designed oh, yes. from that so, many years yes. ago. It's when you, can, when you think nice. about 25 years, oh, yes. uh, how's, how's a lot's happened in 25 years. <laughs> one of my cheerleaders on the San Francisco 49ers. Yes, when she was my director. Mm -hmm. yep. So um, I actually started, obviously, you know, way back in, in the day and have been actually taking dance for over 35 years. Well, taking and teaching, I should say. Been involved in dance for over 35 years. Um, I've been teaching at the same place for 22. After high school, I went on to work for United Spirit Association USA staff and then went on to cheer for the San Francisco 49ers. And I amazing cheered, dancer, this one. Uh, yeah. Amazing director. And, um, you guys want Work well together. Yes, very well. He's a director, amazing very dancer. Well. I've known her forever. When she was yes. in high school, I knew her before she was cheering so on. You're recruiting her. Well, I was because she was a legend in the town. You know, and everybody wanted to be Angela. So it's pretty neat to be able to work underneath her and have that experience because she truly. Uh, the other day, somebody said, "Who has shaped your life the most?" And I said, "Personally or professionally?" Because of course, you're always going to go with your mom personally. But on a professional level, Angela was the person that I said, and I, and I mean that from the bottom of my heart. So everything that she taught me. Um, so from 95 to 99, and then in 99. Um, in 99, I got to do Pro Bowl, which was really probably the highlight of me being on wow. the San Francisco 49er team. I was captain and then got to do Pro Bowl, and it was a very, very special time. But truly, the impact this woman has had on me, on everybody on our team, and then beyond that, this industry with the uniforms. I mean, how many women came up to you tonight and they said, they came up to me and they said, is that Angela King? <laughs> yes, it is. And you, you know, you caught yeah. one of those well, I got one. instances, we got, we got which is awesome. <laughs> because everybody, when your name is brought up, it's just like she's this goddess in the industry. And it's That's pretty because I'm old. No. <laughs> I've just, just been around a Legendary lot. is yeah. the right Legendary. word. Legendary. I think that's more appropriate. More appropriate. It's not old by any means. So. So, so, Angela, you got the fashion stuff going on. you got the uniforms going on right now. And that's full yeah, force. Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah. And, you know, the thing was, when I was cheering, what made me start the company in the first place 25 years ago was that whenever I put on a costume, the costumes weren't being made by dancers. They were just being made by people who made costumes. Mm -hmm. So they didn't know what it was like to put it on and move around and dance around and what that felt like and, and if something wasn't right, how that affected your performance. So for me, and you can call me the crazy old costume lady, <laughs> but I still to this day in my office put on every costume <laughs> that leaves and I dance around my office. I mean, it's not crazy like that sounds. I like do a kick. I'm like, if, if I move around, is it going to creep? Is it going to crawl? Because it's important for my customers. Yeah, absolutely. And so, yeah, and so my employees and get a good laugh. video of that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'll send it your yeah, direction. Yeah. And here's what's funny is that my customers sometimes are like, can we see a picture of it? And I'm like, really? <laughs> so I have to put on the costume and I tell my staff, you cut my head off. I do not want my face in any of these pictures, so I'm like, <sighs> try to suck it up. And my, I think my customers do it just to get a laugh, like yeah. Angela put on that costume. She really did it. You know, she put the costume yeah. on. And she can but, still rock 
pocket. <laughs> because it's important for patterning and everything else, because everything we do is custom for our customer, and we make it. And so it's important that you can dance in it. That's why I started the company to begin with. It was for dancers. So to have somebody who knows what that means and how that's supposed to fit and how it affects you professionally when you're performing mm -hmm. makes all the difference in the world. But you know what? There couldn't be a better reward than being in a place like tonight and having people come up and tell me how whatever I did for their costumes affected them and how they remembered it or what I mean that's way better than anything else. Oh.